Ang Pilipino ang mga pangkilalang ito. Stay closer for longer with fresh breath and white smile. Close up, deep action. This is not just a toothpaste. This is close up. The new Samsung Galaxy E Series. It's E extra bright with its Super AMOLED display and has E extra large 5 inch and 5.5 inch screen. All for the extraordinary you. Get the Samsung Galaxy E Series now. Play to be beautiful? Show your hair's unlimited possibilities without worrying about damage. Dove with Keratin Actives nourishes your hair to repair damage inside out so you can keep playing and keep being beautiful. Go play! Stay closer for longer with fresh breath and white smile. Close up, deep action. This is not just a toothpaste, this is close up. Magandang gabi. Ito ang News TV Live. Sunod na rin nag-anunsyo ng taas presyo sa ilang produktong petrolyo ang ilang kumpanya ng langis. Simula alas 12.01, mamayang madaling araw, magpapatupad ang shell ng pisot 10 sentimong taas presyo sa kada litro ng gasolina, 80 sentimo sa kada litro ng kerosene at 60 sentimong taas presyo sa kada litro ng diesel. Epektibo alas 6 ng umaga bukas, magpapatupad ng kaparehong dagdag presyo ang petron sa gasolina, kerosene at diesel. Nauna namang nag-anunsyo ng oil price hike ang mga kumpanyang PT Philippines, Total, Flying V, Phoenix Petroleum at Sea Oil. Ayon sa mga oil company, ang dagdag presyo ay alin sunod daw sa presyuhan sa pandaigdigang merkado. Pirmado na ni Pangulong Noynoy Aquino ang resolusyong magtataas ng arawang allowance ng mga uniformed personnel mula sa iba't ibang ahensya ng pamahalaan. Ayon kay Presidential Spokesperson Edwin Lacerda, mula siyam na pung piso itataas sa isang daan at limang pung piso ang allowance ng mga personnel. Kabilang sa makakakuha ng dagdag na allowance ay ang mga tauhan ng Armed Forces of the Philippines, Philippine National Police, Bureau of Fire Protection, Bureau of Jail Management and Penology, Philippine Coast Guard, National Mapping and Resource Information Authority. Epektibo ang resolusyon January 1, 2015. Kukunin ang pondo mula sa savings ng Department of National Defense, Department of Interior and Local Government, Department of Transportation and Communications, and Department of Environment and Natural Resources. At yan po ang may init na balita sa oras na ito. Tutok lang dito sa GMA News TV para oras-oras alam mo. Ako po si Teresa Zafra. Magandang gabi. Welcome back mga kapuso. We're talking about hot relationships and not hot relationships until marriage. Do you feel guilty that You know, having loved your wife so, so well and so fully, the first that one. you have, that you now have transferred all your allegiance mm. to Miriam. No, I uh, see because my belief is that she's now practically my sister in heaven. The day that she died, sa death bed niya, meron po kami mga last rites na ginawa. Very, it was something na parang spontaneous lang na ginawa ng kaibigan ko na pastor. Ang ginawa niya, RD, si Tingting, yung asawa mo dito ngayon sa lupa. Uh, sa lupa. Pero ngayon, uh, magiging bride na siya ni Christ. I-walk down mo siya sa aisle. Ang ginawa ko po yung kamay niya. So, napasalamat ako sa kanya. Does it give you any insecurity? In the beginning, Tita, I had that insecurity. You had? Actually came up when we finally moved into this house where we live. And that was the house that he built with his first wife. Uh -uh. He gave me a budget for the renovation. And then, sabi ko, but I want to add more. I have my own money. I can add. Yun pala, na-realize ko na kaya pala, wanted I wanted it. to take over and change it because I wanted to have my own say. Kaya pala ako merong insecurity nun kasi feeling ko, first runner-up na naman ako. God has also used RD to reassure me. He would tell me, you know what? 
Ting Ting is now my sister in heaven. You are my wife here on earth. So you are now my first priority. When did you stop crying? I think po, you never really stop remembering and grieving. It, parang lagi naman siya magiging part ng buhay ko. Pero gratefulness yung nasa puso ko, hindi guilt. There is a child there. Yes. That's Joshua. Ano ang reaction niya sa iyo? Bago pa siya nanligaw sa akin, si Joshua na nung nag, ang nagpe-pray at nagwi-wish para kay RD na magkaroon ulit ng panibagong asawa. In hey. fact, nung nag-birthday siya noong <coughs> April 8, sabi niya, na-wish ko dad na si mami uh, nasa heaven at masaya siya para sa atin, na, na okay na tayo. Tsaka, wish ko rin na magkaroon ka na ng bagong asawa. Sabi niya, Dad, I wish you have a new wife so I can have a new mom. So, nung nililigaw na niya ako, tumawag siya sa akin, kinuha ni Joshua yung telepono, sabi niya, Is that Tita M? Hi, my name is Joshua. My dad's going to marry you. <laughs> ano ang role niya sa wedding niyo? Was he best a flower man. or best man? Best man. And ring bearer. Bible, ring bearer. Tapos nag-exchange vows din sila sa mm -hmm. wedding namin. And nagbigay siya sa akin ng sing-sing. Ako naman nagbigay sa kanya ng bracelet. Ay, how nice. From now on, I will be your mom. I will take care of you. Tapos sabi naman niya sa akin, uh, from now on, you are, parang you are my mom. I won't give you any headaches. <laughs> yeah. Where did you spend your honeymoon? We stayed din Tagaytay. The week after, nagpunta kami sa Phuket. And then, a month later, nagpunta kami sa Europe. And then, meron pa sa US. And you feel na yung inyong constraining yourselves from having a sexual, mm -hmm. an active sexual yeah. life mm -hmm. before your marriage has helped yeah. your marriage. Yes, in fact, it, in, in the first... Tandaan nyo yung mga kapuso, mm -hmm. ha? Pwede palang gawin nyo. <laughs> Actually, it was much sweeter kasi nga, second time namin dalawa, di ba? So, Sabi namin nung sa Phuket kami, after making okay. love the whole day, or, yeah, or sure. honeymooning the whole day, uh -huh. sabi wow, it's so, this, we should tell everyone that this is the way it should be because it's so, it's it's not anticlimactic. Yes. Uh -huh. ano, parang and it's not really shameless, it's shameless. It's, and for you, it turned out beautifully. What if we don't fit? Because I just trusted that whoever God will choose for yeah. me will be perfect for me. In fact, Tita, Isa po dun sa, sa 38 na check uh -oh. kay RD should be great lover. Pero in contrast dun sa first marriage ko, Tita, uh -oh. we were not, we were practicing premarital sex. Uh -oh. But after we got married, sex was one of the problems that we had in that marriage. Uh -huh. Ito po ang listahan. <laughs> Spiritual. Godly man after God's heart. Uh -huh. Wise spirit-led leader at the center of God's, God's will. will. Financial, good provider, capable, mm -hmm. stable, mm -hmm. accomplished, mm -hmm. achiever, mm -hmm. mental, intellectual, great conversationalist, yes. obviously, smart, yes. interesting, yes. we grow together, yes. emotional, romantic, yes. healthy, fit, mm -hmm. Ayan, fit na nga, ano, mm -hmm. ah. great kisser. Mm -hmm. <laughs> How? Why, why do you, think you want us to demonstrate? Yes, no. absolutely. Oh, you know, 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 in shoes. Like, Sabi ko gusto ko siyang i-surprise na sa wedding day namin eh, 5 ako. <laughs> RD, what were your requirements? Hindi ko naman kailangan ng beauty queen. Uh -huh. Kasi, my first size, ting -ting maganda naman siya Wala na siyang title. Uh -huh. Pero nakita ko, in the face of sickness and death, yung beauty, it just fades away eh. Natitira na lang talaga yung character. Yung hinahanap ko na, na yung spiritual compatibility is there. Is there. Tapos sobrang bonus na yung Miss Universe siya. Maybe you would like to give some advice to people who are looking for their God's best mm -hmm. for them. Number one qualification, paghanap ng lalaking ta merong tatlong C ang karakter. Dapat ang taong uh, mabuti ang karakter ay magiging mabuting asawa din. Number two, dapat marunong siyang mag-commit Aanin mo ang lalaki, nakapakakasalan ka nga, pero mangigib, mga ngapit bahay naman. Pangatlo, dapat meron siya ni Kristo. Nasa isip ko, 
yung kasabihan na maraming taong tumitingin lang sa external. Ay, maganda. Da- maganda magdala ng damit. Uh, hot. Pero God looks at the heart. Dapat tayo rin, tumitingin din tayo sa puso. Sa mga kapuso, ayan, you have one of the great love stories of the decade, maybe the century, <laughs> etc. But it is a love that is second time around. Mm-hmm. And it, there is such a thing as true love, I suppose, and love that does not have to go over yung the, the bounds of what you call morality, etc. Here is her book, and here is Ardi's book, one of Ardi's book. So thank you very much, Ardi and Miriam. It was delightful mm-hmm. thank you, having Paul. heard your stories. Thank you, Paul. Ang susunod na programa ay rated PG, patnubay at gabay ng mag